Help me with this. Right, let's get back to the ship.
Give me a hand with this.
Give me a hand! Give me a hand over here! <clears throat> hey! Can't do this alone! Come here a moment! Not so fast. Hand over the key. Fine! Loki cut it off. Only Loki knows. But Thor was less than pleased. Loki wisely chose to make amends. A new head of hair for Sif, finer than the last. And so he set off for Svartalfheim. At Loki's request, Evaldi's sons made for him tresses of the purest gold, 
which would fix the Sith's scalp and grow as real hair would. Loki had what he needed, but now that he'd seen what the Master Smiths of Svatzalfheim could do, he wanted more. What enraged the beast? I haven't the faintest idea. One minute I was frying some bacon, and the next, that brute was trying to steal it! You... were cooking? Here? Of course! Damn well lost my appetite now, though, haven't I? Stupid bear. I'm not so sure it's the bear who was stupid. Of course. This is yet another tale within the cursed saga that is my life. That's right! I am cursed. This damn ring. Nothing but bad luck ever since I got it. Are you sure you know the difference between bad luck and a bad choice? So? I have taken it upon myself to rid the world of the ring and its cursed sather. I shall destroy it. And I'd jolly well appreciate it if you accompanied me. You seek my protection for disposing of a ring? Not just any ring. A cursed ring. Cursed by a Jotun witch. A Jotun witch? Now you have my interest. Tell me your tale as we walk, and you will have my aid. This ring... Cursed ring! This cursed ring. How did you acquire it? Focus on the destination, not the journey! Ours shall end soon, atop this very mountain. Finally, my unlucky saga will end! Oh, that damn bear. Its claws couldn't claim me, but hunger still might. Didn't you say you lost your appetite? His boss! My heroic voyage requires sustenance! Oh, <laughs> I am saved! Mushrooms, and so colorful. Stop! Do not eat those mushrooms! They're... You truly are an idiot, aren't you? <coughs> oh, curse that ring! It somehow poisoned the mushrooms! Just stay there, and don't eat anything else off the ground. I'll get something you can eat. Oh, you are... You are kind. Do hurry, though. <coughs> oh, my stomach! <coughs> Some actual food will settle it. Possibly. Good thinking. You, uh, happen to have any? Uh, that bear got all of mine. Here, eat this. Oh. Um, well, uh, I guess it will have to do. Well, let's not dally any further. Oof. Come along. You mentioned a Jotun witch. Did she give you the ring? Or was she the one who cursed it? Oh, I cannot say for sure. I saw her travel. She was in a hurry. I to question her, you see. A Jotun? Alone? Obviously up to no good. Did you happen to catch her name? Of course. 
Hir o Kin, I think? Hurricane. You saw her in Svatzalfheim. Pretty sure it was Hir o Kin. Either way, she gave me the ring. Just gave it to me. Told me it would bring me good luck, but that it must be kept far away from her for the magic to work. I have used the exact same tactic with my children, more than once. No, you misunderstand. She gave me the wrong ring. This one is cursed. Nothing but bad luck happening to me all the time. <sighs> it's so draining. But the end of my suffering is nigh. We're almost there. Come on, this looks like a shortcut. path is surely clear enough for you now. Well, the land could be flatter, but I suppose this will do. Now, let me tell you more of my perilous plight. Why, my bad fortune would make even Gavalacy look like the luckiest dwarf alive. I suggest silence. Less, um, chance of being overheard by further dangerous animals. Yes, yes, good thinking. My words cannot be unlucky if they are unspoken. You are wise. Here. We are here. My salvation is finally at hand. Then do not delay. Rid yourself of the ring. Cursed ring! How many times... Have you even been listening? More than I would like. Cursed ring, yes. Go on, get it done. Yes. I shall finally be free of this torment, this burden. I know the feeling. Be gone, foul... <laughs> Very unfortunate. Luck rubs off on me. Oh dear! Oh dear! I say, this is 
most, most unpleasant. Get me down at once. Someone, anyone. Oh, oh bugger. Oh, how undignified. Help. In hindsight, I wish you had a quicker way of killing this one. What? World face you. A curse. You have nothing to fear. Oh, thank you, thank you, stranger. Always a pleasure to see such ruffians meet their demise. Endanger me? <laughs> That's what you get, eh? <laughs> uh, sure. I'll be on my way. Now, however can I repay you for saving my precious, ambitious, far-from-over life? Ah! I know. Meet me at the Grenheller shelter, and I'll see you get a hero's reward. <laughs> That's really not necessary. No, no, I insist. And look here, if you want to give some more baddies what for, they're gathered on the Black Beach. Do you know it? South of where those ghastly war animals are made. Frightful business. Methinks they were going to meet with the Jotun, would you believe? Black Beach, you say? Perhaps I'll take a look. It's my least favorite beach, for sure. But alas, who visits the seaside in times like these? <laughs> now, see you at the shelter. Toodaloo! Wait! Oh, wait! People! Get away from me! Off! Off! Go 
Are you harmed? I was going to ask you the same. I live thanks to you. You fought with more bravery than I could muster. I have had a lot of practice. I'd give you something in thanks. But I must have dropped my pack while I tried to get away. Find safety. That will be reward enough. Nonetheless, I'd like to give you something. If you know of the Greenhelir shelter, cave full of huge crystals, stop by and see me. The animals, you know? I swear I heard them speak. Thought I was going mad. Until I saw they were Jotnar. They said something about regrouping with their pack. On a black beach, west of Sudra Milna, I think. Does that mean anything to you? I'm not sure, but I may seek out this black beach and see what they spoke of. Be on your guard, and thank you again. Maybe I'll see you at the Grenheller shelter. Hey, what is it? Why the wailing? It's... it's... <laughs> Speak freely. My beloved Bo, I never got to say goodbye. He was fixing the roof when he slipped and fell, and now he's... he's... <laughs> I, I see. Perhaps it's not too late to help him. If all she wants is to say a final goodbye, I think I can help. What in the blazes? I'm alive! I am alive! Oh, thank you! Thank you, stranger! <laughs> what luck to have this second chance! Oh, never again shall I take even a moment of my time for granted! Darling, I... And never again shall I step out onto that perilous roof of mine. Repairs? Ah, there's more to life than maintaining tiles. Look out, world! Here I come! Yes, so well, I'll, um, I'll see what I can do. You're alive, yes. Now shut up. She has something to tell you. Oh, right. And uh, who would you be, miss? Don't you recognize me? 
Bo. It's leave. Your love. I've uh, never laid eyes upon you, miss. Lovely as you are. You must have hit your head when you died. Have you forgotten our passion? The life we built in this house. Look, Bo, where did you hide the treasure? Um, our treasure. Treasure? What treasure? Would you give it a rest? Why do you keep bringing me back? To satisfy my curiosity. You. Do you know her? Never met her before today. You. What is the meaning of all this? Uh... Where's my house key? You robbed me when I was dead! Fine? Yes. When I saw you fall, I thought, finally, I can take the valuables I know you've got stashed in your house. Maybe the house, too. But with all the moose spells around, you can keep your stupid key. Good day. Oh, leave me in peace, the pair of you. Not so fast. Hand over the key. Or you are painfully lonely. Which is it? Hmm? Actually, you know what? I don't care. Mortal concerns are no longer mine. Go on, piss off with ya! What? What is so important that you can't just leave me alone? I already told you, my house and anything inside is yours. Now kindly sod off for good! What? Dark spirits torment this land. in the rain maskers.
stone could be useful. Here are vigilant. 